Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Man, we right back at it again. It's part two. Pop that balloon. Well, find love. I'll be getting the name mixed up sometime. Pop the balloon to find love, man. We we right back at it to part two, man. Y'all just seen part one. This it's part two. We doing it, man. I had to break it down, man, because it's kind of long. It's kind of long. Pause. But here we go, man. Let's get into it, man. Go ahead and bring out our next single guy. See this nigga. Hello, welcome in. I'll hey. hold this. What's your name? I'm Zach. Zach, how old are you? 37. 37. Okay, what do you do? Uh, this I'm an nigga. analyst. I work for the DOD. Okay, very nice. And now, what do you look for in a woman? Um, this I'm nigga. looking for a woman to be her authentic self, to be at her most feminine. Okay, all right. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? She got to know how to ride a motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm not looking for anything artificial. Um, I know this is like the BBL era, and BBL, you know they're guys that, they're, they're here for that. But I don't BBL, want. I don't want. So. Okay, natural. That's natural. what you're looking for. Show okay. me something right, natural. Cool. Like so we ass did get a pop balloon. Let's go on over there mm. and see why they. Let me just like no. Nope. Start over here. Come on. <laughs> yeah, All right, nigga, we what have nigga? your name and wow. age and why you ended up popping. Nigga shaped like a ninja turtle. My name is Brittany. I'm 31. And I've popped it just because I don't want to waste time. I just caught it like you're not like my type. Um, uh, you, you seem cool. I like your answers. I like the natural mm -hmm. thing. Um, but I just didn't want to waste your time. This nigga, this time, nigga so Jack nasty. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Nigga dress and now weird. is she nigga someone that's your built? type? Mm -hmm. I mean, she just said no, so let's move along. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, damn. <laughs> All right, then. She if we can no, have your name and along. age and why you ended up popping. Hi, he I'm ugly. Nova. I'm 30. And I'm a halfer. I got my chichis done, but the rest is me. <laughs> so oh. I don't know if you could, or I don't know. Yeah, that's it pretty much. Well, you're a gorgeous lady. Thank you for your time. Thank you. <laughs> this nigga ain't wanting and then nobody. We did get one over here as oh, well. she still like him? Your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Unique. I'm 31. Ooh, and I nice popped just you. because he reminds me of someone. Ooh. You remind me of hey. You remind me. No, let's stop. <laughs> But he, I mean, he seems cool. Look how she I looking mean, at him. I'm looking at her, her screech looking at him. That he said about himself, I kind of was like, okay, let me get the balloon back so I could see more. Mm. But he do remind me of some, someone. Okay. So that that was mm. a... Okay. That nigga creepy. No problem. Somebody cute. <laughs> I'm going to take that as a yes. <laughs> Look, I don't judge by off of... I don't judge by off of um, looks. Just off of personality and how you are as a man. You seem cool, though. This okay. nigga. Well, thank you. You like screw face. Right. Let's head back over old, here. What do you call that movie? All right. Ah! If we can have your name and age and why you're popping wet. your balloon. My name is Brenda. I'm 36. Look at the old Steven Seagal movie. Hello, Brenda. Hello. <laughs> the reason why I pop my balloon, it's your fashion sense. Is she whack? I want to walk with somebody who's confident enough to wear something that matches. That you want him. Energy, so. You want to be confident to watch to watch yeah. some shit you got on. So you're not really feeling the style. I need confident oh, in that not. shit he got on. That's, Unfortunately, that's... but good looking. Wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now is Brenda someone that's your? They like yeah, that nigga swag. Um, possibly. I mean, Swag's she's gorgeous, but again, off. she said I don't match her style. I didn't hear anything else about her, so I don't know. Maybe looks wise, I mean, everybody up here is attractive, so. But I, it's, it's got to be more than that, you know? Got it. Okay. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> <All right. laughs> your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Jador. I'm 31. Um, I didn't want to be shallow again, so that's why I was, like, giving it time. But it's, you know, it's the fashion sense. Um, I wasn't initially attracted to you, but then when you kept talking, my thing is uh, when you said authenticity. That's the. Uh, so you really, you didn't want really to be shallow at first. I want somebody you just waited to be shallow. In the person that God made them. Now what they see on TV Ooh. and you know what I'm saying. So you when that? you said that, I was like, yeah. But Trying to put on the Batman sense. sleeve now. And I hate I hate to seem shallow. I really do because you this, seem man. like a great guy. I don't know why I like it. But it's nothing wrong no with more. being handsome. I was like putting it, it on. It was just that I was like, damn. I did when I used to hoop. Yeah, so that's basically it. But you're very handsome. There's nothing wrong with you. 
Okay. All right. So I know you said they're all attractive up here, but is she someone that if you saw her out, like, would you approach her? I'm like, hell no. Nah. Um, no, not necessarily. Okay. Um, Damn. Yeah, you, you so lying, man. You ain't no there catch, are men nigga. There like T and A. I tend to be a hair man, mm. so like the first thing that I'm going to notice on the woman is going to be her hair. And then from there, like, I am going to look at your figure because I'm a man. Mm -hmm. But Because I'm a man. Oh, no, no, you got to have no excuse. Everything is about, like, a whole and package. And like she said, my style isn't vibing with her. Her style ne isn't necessarily vibing with me. Mm -hmm. But I love the greens. Thank you. Love the shades of green. <laughs> you do have a lot of great taste. So I, I, I won't you. take that from you. I appreciate you. All right. Oh, okay. Perfect. Thank you. What's going over here? Oh, you went on, to your Ford. Ford dealer and got a used vehicle with Ford Blue Advantage, and you've never felt more confident. Your Good Ford okay, tough. if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. I am Tatiana. I'm 25. You seem like the most nicest man on the planet. I do not. Oh, oh. shit. Oh. <laughs> Okay, shoot. Mm -hmm. No, you just you just came off like you like I, I would not want to break your heart. Like I would feel like such a jerk if I ever like Oh well thank you. She a man either. But um I feel like no man wants to hear you're just the nicest thing. That's like it's a, it's well, I mean, compliment. damn, take that as a compliment because a lot of guys are jerks. I mean, like, if you're nice, that's great. Like a lot of girls like nice guys for real, for real, but like you I feel well, like you would do better with like finding you know the nice guy trope out of that than being like the dickhead. Oh, sorry to cuss, but <laughs> I feel it, man. This, okay. this bitch and you look like Schoolboy Q to me, and I really dig oh. that. Oh. That's not a bad thing. I fuck with Q. <laughs> See, I, I knew. Like, I, like, I knew I like something. Q. I just I've never heard that before. Like before I had before I had like locks. I've heard Nelly. I've heard heard Pharrell, and now Schoolboy Q. Pharrell. Who <laughs> <laughs> told you that? I, I don't want to get into it. It's, <laughs> I, would, I would have to show you the pictures. But either way, it's like, it's always somebody different, and none of the people look like each other. So I'm like, but you do uh, look like schoolboy Q. Like I the glasses. That part. But, <laughs> no, I feel you. No, I feel you. But, uh, like, um, yeah. I, kind of you, you seem like you cool, though. I like, I I like, I, I I like I, a schoolboy Q, man. I would not want to end up, like, getting in a relationship with you. And too then, like, going far and then, like, breaking like up. Now we can't box, even be cool like that. Like, I can see you as, like, a really, really great home. Oh, well, I need some female friends that I haven't slept with. That would be excellent. If it's not weird, I got you, bro. Like, if you want to be bro, you can be bro. What? See what I tell you, man. She, she wanted the homies. Okay. All right. Cool. Thank you. That's she gonna wind up smashing the homie. All right. Danger. Have your name she and smashed the homies. You ended up Danger. Hi, I'm Micah. I'm 33, and I just I, you said you like figure and shape and stuff, so I just felt like it wouldn't be a match. Ah, so. man. That's that's, what, that's what you caught. That's what you said. Oh, I apologize if, take a, take if a that that was now. the main thing that you caught that I was looking for is figure and shape. One of the main things. Yeah, and then also the outfit too. I just I don't see that bitch. Yeah, you almost had just, a chance. I just, I just wasn't attracted initially, so. I mean, I get it. I'm about to get back on this bike, so it yeah. is. What it I is. knew that nigga was on a motorcycle. You. Oh, you can't <laughs> fit, bitch. You had to get a sidecar. Thank you. And I love the printed dress. Thank you. And the accessories. You've done an amazing job. I appreciate that. Thank you. Okay. All right. Thank you. Uh, well, that is there. all of I the balloons dunk. popped. Unfortunately, we weren't able to find you a match today, but yeah, thank man, you so much for coming on. Who knew? <laughs> we knew, oh, nigga. Listen, um, on a serious note, thank y'all all for coming, even the ones that were like pop right off the bat. And um, I know maybe I didn't come you like kids slave. looking like what y'all thought I should look like, but I can't dress. That ain't my problem. I don't care about fashion. Look, I care more confident. about the adventures we're going to go on together. Mm. So He can get two or three of them bitches off that right there. Time. I'm sorry for having wasted y'all time. And y'all have a good night. Look. <laughs> this nigga, he from the double back. Let's give it up for him then, ladies. He from the double back. Thank you. Thank you for coming. He gonna double back. <laughs> Look, see? Okay, let's go see, ahead and bring out our next single nigga guy. That nigga won the bitches. Let's see this nigga. Hello, welcome in. I'll have you hold this. What's oh, your name? Uh, my name is Ontario. Ontario? Ontario. How old are you? I'm 34. 34? Okay. What do you blue, do? Blue uh, dreads? Do videography, comedy, and photography. Comedy. Okay, it's okay. And now what do you look for in a woman? 
I look for in a woman uh, confidence Shoot, and like that someone that's self sufficient and has like Some Amex, just what I do. herself together. Hmm. Okay. Whether it be emotionally, uh, financially, you got so, blue dreads sure. though. Can you take them serious? And now, uh, what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, kids. Oh. Um. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So that's your you only deal breaker. Uh, that's definitely my deal breaker. Okay, all right. Hey, so come on, a dating a show. You better find that. You better find that wild unicorn. Going over them right. and see what's going wild, on. Nigga. Hold on, this bitch. All right. This nigga look like have um, your name and age. Tyree Talbert. I'm Jador. I'm 31. Okay. Right. And Jador, why did you end up popping your balloon? Because he got blue dreads. Oh. Okay, all right. All right. And now, how many kids do you have? Five. Five. God damn! At 31. The oldest. My oldest is eight. Eight. He's just I was like, five and eight years. <laughs> You're busy. Damn. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn. That's not bad, though. That's good, though. Get to that, though. Yeah. Oh, no. Bitch, don't be ashamed of your kids, kids, ho. I love my kids. Oh, about, okay. Oh, okay. All right, now. I hope we didn't get to that. Bitch, we need to, if you're trying to find somebody out here, that need to be some of your first things. I got five kids at 31. Damn. Boy, the Kelly Blue Book value on that motherfucker went down. <laughs> now, um, prior to her saying, you know, she has kids and all that stuff, is right. she someone that is your type? Uh, I, I'll be honest. I'm not much into weave on it either. Okay. And then that would be my other deal breaker too. Got you. Okay. Thank you. Oh, thank you. All right. If we can have your name and age. Brittany, 31. Okay. And Brittany, why'd you end up popping your balloon? Same. Um, you saying deal breaker is kids. I have one. Yeah, one. And then you also said weave. I think we all most of us have weave in our head, so I'm like. He just said that though. <laughs> but I do both, so. But I'm that's just. It. So that's why you got a nice smile though. Thank you, thank you. You do too. Thank you. All right. Now is Brittany someone that's your type? Yeah, she's very pretty. Thank you. Thank you. He like dark skin girls. He had light skin. Okay, baby. your name and age. Look like Nova, and I'm 30. Mm -hmm. I have uh, one kid. She's 10. You take that down. Um, so. That was your deal breaker. I think you had and I don't want to leave. <laughs> <laughs> See, that would have been. I like that. Yeah. And you have a lovely smile, too. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. And now, <laughs> what, prior to you know him making that statement, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Um, because I wanted to learn more about him. Um, he is attractive. And Tyrese Halliburton. I'm short, so he's tall enough. <laughs> so you got a beak on him. Nigga look like. Um, All right. And now. Is she someone that you would approach? I know you said kids are day breaker, but still. I got you. <laughs> but I approach. I might approach you. Yeah, okay. I'll approach you. Okay. All right. And then we got one more over on, here. Have a bird. Your name and age, and why you ended up popping. My name is Unique. I'm 31. How many kids you got? I pop because of the kids. Okay. How many you got? Right. And now, how many kids do you have? I have two. 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 Okay. You got less than all. Prior that to him making that, that statement, in the hood. is he someone Fucking. that is your type? Yeah, he seemed, I, I mean, eight, like what? I said before, I have a specific have type. 22, 21, some shit like that? Oh, I don't know and my specific. type, I mean, <laughs> I'm trying to get away from my type, if that makes sense. I'm used to dr drug dealers. All right, I got you. Game well, not, yeah, See? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and I'm trying to get away from that. Okay. Light skin, that's what I was the dreads, well, I, I tell you. you. Okay. Okay. Young <laughs> light now, is unique to someone you would approach? I would, honestly, no. It's only because, man, fuck, you man. have a lot of hair. <laughs> right, <laughs> I'm right. Like, I would trip walking next to you. I like, I, I mean. Yeah, no, I it looks like good. Like. No, it looks amazing. I'm very I like unique. A lot. I, said, yeah. I step outside the box. Yeah. How much hair do you really locks. got, though, bitch? Yeah, I like true. this. <laughs> you like that? You say you probably got a Thank doodle you. stain on one of your dreads. Okay, so we do nigga, still have back. three. You gotta move all this shit, or it might be that I'm in the shower. I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these ladies a question to kind of help you narrow you get down. Dreads caught in your ass Oof. crack. All right. Um, what do you do like daily now? Like, what's like your? That's hobbies? some dumb ass question. Okay, what, what are some you of your do hobbies? Uh, along basis, with your though. name and your age. Yes, my name is Brenda, 36. I just started doing pottery. Pottery. Yeah. Pottery. All right. What made you get into pottery? Okay. Uh, the ceramics. She watched Ghost. The shapes. Of she watched Ghost, so she want to do some. Well, you're going to make a pot out of it, right? <laughs> so the art artistry of it is very beautiful behind it. And obviously, it's like soothing. So You want to be on Ghost. Yeah. You want to be on the movie Ghost. You want Patrick Swayze and Demi Moore mm -hmm. be holding you Next and lady. jump into Whoopi Goldberg's lips. This is it. The moment of truth. Open your eyes and look clearly at what's going on around you. I have some news that I'll cheer you up. Sorry, these things happen. Kinds of kindness. That might be good. All right, what are some of your hobbies? 
No, are we good? Um, well, white wait, people do I have move? some money? I'm sure. Yes. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I'm Tatiana. Um, I'm she 25. She's crazy in that poor thing. Uh, my hobbies anyway, right now, I would have to say definitely graphic designing. I do a little bit of like job wise, like I do commissions and then like just draw on the side if anything. And then recently I started she getting into the nipple. studio a little that bit. Like I am not a rapper, but I am an artist. All right. So, Her top, don't she like Herman like Monster? Poetry, like spoken word. You Lily. See? And anything really, anything. if the beat sounds nice. Respect that. I like that. Okay. All right. Your name and age, and what are some of your hobbies? Hi, I'm Micah. I'm 33, and 33. some of my hobbies: I like to hike, I like to cook, and I like to read. I bet I can ride on this bitch back. I can get on her. Mm. She can carry really? nigga. She's <laughs> sturdy. <laughs> what, what do you like to cook? Though? Where are you from? I'm from California, but I oh. live in Dallas. Right. So you Dallas, know, oh. like tacos or what do you make? I don't know what California is like. Tacos. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can make tacos, but I like to cook a little bit of everything. Um, I do like meal prepping and stuff, so oh, I on. like making different like pasta dishes, chicken, but like healthier. So hey, yeah, All right. a little bit of everything. She has some good skin yeah, too. Good. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay. Going back down now. So now, what are some of your I'm hobbies? Since night. you asked the ladies, I'm pretty sure they want to know. Uh, some of my hobbies, I love, I play music a lot. Um, I mean, I'm also like a casual guy. I play video games and all that too. <laughs> I work out all the time. That's another hobby. And My brother in the uh, NBA. <laughs> I talk a lot of trash. That's why I play, that's why I do comedy. So I make like a lot of fun of a lot of things. So there's that too. Yeah. All right, bitch, I ain't no joke. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go on over here. Why did we end up popping? First of all, great attitude. Um, well put together. Um, it's the talking trash. Yeah. Bitch. I like to talk trash too. So I don't think we can match up to that. No? Yeah. Fair enough. All right. Yeah. All right. He don't, he don't care. He want her no way. Banter. Can't keep up. You know, it can be I think he wanted the one toxic. with the hips down there. Yeah. She got one we don't want to go there. Mm. Fair mm. enough. I mean, I think communication, that's, that's like a part of communication. Isn't that Avion Crack? Like, I feel like goofy as shit. That's what this nigga looks like. you know? But. It depends but on to what extent it. is your honesty? Oh, I'm very honest. Give it them shoes, nigga. <laughs> I think honest. I got one oh, shirt to okay. match that shit. Example. All them colors together. <laughs> if you ask me if a dress made you look big, I would probably say it when it wasn't the dress. Cause you got it. Like, you see, that nigga much. ain't got no. <laughs> he got on two. Just two colors Next. with that. <laughs> you got to find the right shit to go with them shoes. And I'll tell you, I got like one shirt that'll match that motherfucker. We do. An have, and that's fucked I up. Feel, I feel like you're shit. an honest person. You said that. <laughs> so we do. Watch shoes be crazy. Ladies ladies like, Damn, we only got like one thing to go with this. For him. Okay, let's go down. Let's have a white tee. You can go with white tee and some. That's fine. Look at me talking about fashion. So my question is, uh, where well, you said you don't have kids, right? I don't have any kids. Do you want kids? Maybe. I'm Ooh. on a. I'm on the fence about it. The older I get, maybe. Okay. Yeah. Is there like a reason why? Or? No. Oh, what, is there a reason why? Yeah. Like he want to have fun still, bitch. I mean, honest, I, my father wasn't around much mm -hmm. and I don't want to have to, I don't want to miss out on anything. Like I don't want to have a child with someone that I'm not with and then miss out on that child's life. Like my dad would be with me. Making it happen. Oh, okay. Sorry to hear that, but. Yeah. I sad to and shit. <laughs> <laughs> and then also like, what's the last book you read and why? The last oh. book I read and why? Um, I mean. Charlotte's uh, Web, because funny, my teacher I'm, made I'm me in third grade. <laughs> so that's the last one I read. This last time I read too. I don't know. I gotta ponder a little bit with you. Oh, sure. Why are we pondering? Cause I mean, like I, I'm not gonna lie. Like a lot of things, I definitely can relate lie. with. Like I'm, I'm a little bit more of a ruthless You're just type like of Sandra person. Barnhart, bitch. So my thing is, is would you be able to handle something like that? <laughs> yeah, these. Really? Yeah, these. So mm -hmm. You, you sure? Y'all can play the game easy. together. Yeah. Y'all goofy. Y'all look like a good hmm. match. I don't really know what to ask. That kind of caught me off guard a little bit. I'm not gonna okay. cap with you. Okay. No, that's fine. <laughs> that's a homie love a friend. Oh, okay. Let's see why she ended up popping. What's going on? <coughs> I want kids. I want a family, <laughs> and I want like two, three kids. So the Somebody fact that in you. Fence, I don't want to. I want to have kids with people that show Get out. Get right. someone that's going to walk in the damn supermarket. Niggas going to holler. That's how I end up with it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, she popped up so, alone yeah, and the niggas talking. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, cool. Look, she, she got right, out of it. Damn. Up I want niños. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> like that is like That's a good. for sure thing that I want in my future for sure. And like like she said, like I'm not trying to piggyback like you said, but it is a valid thing. Like if Damn. you don't know, like get with me, like she wanna be stuck with a goofy nigga. I, hear that. I can't I can't shit. do that to you if you don't no, I, hear that. I wouldn't do that to you. Bigger, you know, like, I can't do that to you. Yeah. I wouldn't leave that only y'all down that path anyway. Like You yeah. are right. yeah, you're good. So I appreciate it. <laughs> okay. All right, well, all that is Big all the moves. Through the supermarket. We were not able to hey, find your match today, but let's nah, go ahead and give it up for him, ladies. Nigga, holla, <laughs> I'll take that mic. Damn, nigga, you can get a bitch. <laughs> Who cleans this best? Tide. Get tide. three times the cleaning power when you switch to Tide. Switch your Tide, y'all. Wash your clothes. Wash your ass. Check for .gov on TSA pre-check enrollment websites. It ensures you're dealing with an authorized TSA enrollment provider. I guess, whatever this is about. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. All right, next single nigga. Hello, welcome in. What's oh, your name? Stum- Reggie. Look, oh, Reggie. Lord. Yes. How old are you, Reggie? 36. 36. That's an okay. ugly ass doing? fucking shirt. Um, so I'm a political, I'm um, a project manager for a um, political firm. This also, like teach financial literacy, help people with their credit repair, start businesses, generate passive income. Okay, very cool. And Big now what are you shit off gate. We got on the same um, shirt. Y'all shop in the same place. Y'all. Conversation is key. I feel like communication equals longevity. So mm-hmm. if you can hold a conversation, you're already winning me over. And um, someone can provide peace. Yeah, pants okay. ugly. All right, now what is some of your deal Jordans. Hmm, hey, that might, be, that might be your um, girl. It goes back to the nah, nah, big girl might you know walk out with him. Um, if you can express yourself easily, you look lame. Along perfectly that, fine. That's mm-hmm. a speed um, right there. Not so much interested in cigarette smokers, I would say. Mm, okay. All right. And now, yeah, that bitch um, want a cigarette right like now. That bitch, you, um, you don't smoke, I bitch. I do music, motivational music. Um, but that also, for me, it's, um, it's not what you do. It's she needs smoke. You do the same thing you regularly do with the right person, you can make it a good thing. If I ain't mistaken, that bitch in the green... In the last video, part one, she ain't pop a balloon about smoking. Oh, girl, down there to pop first, you did pop us, you know. Time, something about experiences. Okay, nice. Like she All got right, a so reason to get out of it. Oh, three. Let's go on over there and see what's going on. Okay, if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Jador. I'm 31, and it was really just initial attraction. So I waited because I wanted to hear, you know what I mean, maybe – Get a little more in depth, but it really is just the initial attraction, and there's nothing wrong with you. You're very handsome. Mm-hmm. Okay. No. Nah. So you said it's attraction, but he's handsome. So what is it that? Um, if I was like to see you out and about, I this wouldn't approach great. you. Uncle. I wouldn't be like, oh my god, I really want to talk to him or anything like that. You know what I mean? I nigga swag just, off. Yeah. I know when that guy walks in. That nigga look like. Okay. That nigga the Jordan crossed okay. over and now, pushed in the um, back. Russell. Jador, someone that's your type. It was Brian Russell. Um, how about, so what do you do? <laughs> I'm a marketing manager. Um, I'm a certified behavioral health technician. Like um, Ron Russell, model. like Jordan from the push him in the great, back great, great. and win his um, last championship. So for me, I'm more so like atta- attracted, like I said, to mental, just so I say conversation is key. But I'll say just initial attraction, she definitely dresses well. So absolutely, um, yes, I would definitely approach her. Okay. She dressed loud. Thank you. Shit looked like a right, fabric egg on her fucking feet. Why you ended up popping. Brittany, 31. And um, no just kind of like that when you walked in, I didn't get that vibe. And also, I was trying to look past it, but you look like my uncle. His name is Tony. <laughs> yeah, you like <laughs> Uncle Tony. I kept looking at you and I kept thinking about Uncle Tony. But not that you look old, but you look like you yeah, could you be do. a sibling of his or something. You so like I was just like, that's weird to me. You mm. like Uncle but Tony. That's it. You just look like my Uncle Tony. <laughs> oh, man, do I look like somebody? I'm, 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 I'm a uncle. So I know you're, so you're more of like a mental attraction yes. person. But yeah, see, my, my, my niece and nephew look at me like this old um, nigga. Definitely beautiful smile. Um, for me, I like Dress up so that definitely about someone that would look great next to me as far as dressing. So yeah, forty-five, I, four, yes. four to five, okay. I think. Okay. I don't Let's know. go over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping. I'm Tatiana. I'm 25. Um, you're not ugly. I'm just not attracted. But like we kind of look like we got a little bit of some similar style. I see you got that clear quartz up in yes, there yes, too. Yes. <laughs> I, I really, I really like no, like seriously, like we twinning them like type stuff. So like I, right. I, I like what you got That's on. Y'all got some bullshit. Like, you a bud. <laughs> I, I see you as like a homie. Like I would probably like, you know, if I wanted to see you up, at, like if I saw you off glance, I'd be like, hey, he looks like a pretty cool guy to be friends with. Let me let me check him out as a friend. Don't be even fucking approach me on a okay. Okay. I to make no. friends with what about her? Um, yeah, bubbly personality, outgoing. You can tell she's fine with being herself. So that type of stuff tra- attracts me. So definitely. Okay. Okay. I smoke All cigarettes. All right, your name and age and, and why you ended up popping. My name is Unique. I'm 31. Beautiful name. I love the tiger's eye, the clear corpse, all that cigarette. 
smoking, period. I'm on my journey of getting away from that, and I'm not sure if that's, you know, like Women if I'm going to continue. Or, I'm on a journey, so I don't, that's why I popped. Gotcha. Yeah, um, I ain't never cared, but yeah, I ain't just, never like, had no girl to smoke Other smoking, sure, it's cool, but like cigarettes is just like, the thing for me. It's like, it's, it's a thing for me tough. too. And it wasn't yeah, that why I'm like, I'm on the fourth day. It's the fourth. That I even pushed <laughs> out of not <laughs> fucking because of they did. But I'm not it's just, sure if it's going to last. You know, I'm not saying I'm not sure what I want to do or what I want to accomplish because I most definitely want to get away from it. But that's not, that's a habit that I'm trying to control. So that's why I pop. What's about weed? Anything? Mm-hmm. Okay. I ain't had right girls smoke weed or um, cigarettes. Apart from him saying that, is he someone that is your type though? No, he's not Damn, my type. That I will. I don't mind I'll getting to know. Her. That's what she's saying. If she knew him, she'll fuck you or trying to get to know you. Period. If they was like, at, if they was at the barbecue you. a couple of times, so, no, that nigga swag a show through. She see that he's a good nigga. And now, and apart from her being a cigarette smoker, is she someone that you would approach? Um, I would say yes. I think she's um beautiful. She's um. She said, as she says, she's work, uh, working on herself. Mm-hmm. And so I love growth. I love elevation. So definitely. Like I said, thank you. She see that nigga a couple times. She a fuck. With. Cat lip. That grimy film on your teeth. Doctor G. Teeth. It's actually the buildup of. Plastic. All right, Elam, so we do doctor. still have three balloons <laughs> unpopped. I'm going to have you ask these ladies a question just to kind of help you narrow it down. Okay, perfect. Um, so my question is this. Um, what are your thoughts on leaving a legacy, um, building generational wealth for you and your family? Yeah, and all state man when he played in um, okay, your baseball. Okay, you're naming age. Answer to his question. <laughs> my name is Brenda. I'm 36. You're like Brian Cox. Very good question. When he played um, for the I Jets. think it all depends on the man. What's your vision in order for me to be your co-pilot to make that happen? And the beads on so his arm nasty. To answer that question, it's all about You can put voodoo on the nigga. I'm telling you, that's that nigga from um, that. Major League. It's all about consistency. Move on it's also like about, that. well, some men will think that this may sound intimidating, but having a woman lead sometimes can help a situation to build that generational wealth. Perfect. Yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I know man wanting to hear All that right, shit. name and age and the answer to his question. Yeah, but happen that way, happen that way. I'm 30. Ain't nobody going um, into that right shit Right now, like that. I, I am know. in nursing school. She got to be the leader. I plan nah. on being an aesthetics nurse. I do have my own shop right now where I am practicing my esthetician. Um, so right now, I'm just trying to... I want to have a franchise of beauty bars. That's I, I know what she's talking about, man. My wife my progress. Some of that That's shit, the man. journey I'm on right now. Michael Dermot, the ST, all oh, that yeah. shit, man. She did all that shit. I know that shit. She talking Your about. Your name and age and the answer to his question. I'm that motherfucking machine Hi, I'm calls Micah, too. And I'm 33, and I think that that is why we're here. Like leaving a legacy and creating gener- generational wealth is extremely important to me, and that's why I want a leader in my life. So that way. We can do just that, and I can trust your vision and get beside you somewhere to what my girl down there said, a co-pilot. Uh, and a way that I'm preparing to do that yeah. is just being prepared to be a wife and be in that co-pilot situation this with a man about. that has vision. So. She ready to drop some puppies, yeah. too? Great. Get a litter <laughs> or two out of her. Yeah. <laughs> this bitch right. is peeing on flat shoes. It's nasty, One man. of these ladies' balloons based off of those responses you've got. Okay? Right. Go ahead and pop one of these ladies' balloons. I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to pop this one. Okay. All right. So why did we end up popping hers? Um, first off, your answer was amazing. Definitely great. Um, mm-hmm. I can definitely tell you're an independent woman, which uh, I definitely love that. Um, I would say on this that thing part got with the, the woman leading, like um, having both partners leading is definitely a great thing. But I would say when you're dealing with a man like myself, like I'm, I'm intentful, purposeful, would you mm-hmm. would you know how to allow me to lead you? See? Or would it just be a lot of button hits? No, absolutely. <coughs> That's what I said. If you have a vision, you can definitely be the co-pilot to where we're going. Nah. Got you. So, okay. So Be the damn but Yeah, I would say just um, based off that, um, leading the co-pilot, that's amazing. And um, I've been in situations be where Be the navigator like, or something, bitch. You can't be the pilot. It's, just, it's, it's, it's a lot of, like, arguing back and forth Screaming with that. Screaming the back like, of the head. Let's, let's lead in peace. You know what I mean? We can, we're going to argue with things like this, but... That, that communication part. As long as that's high, I feel like there's nothing we can't get over. 
Absolutely. Thank you. And nigga said, no, you can't be the pilot or the co pilot. You gotta be the navigator. Yeah, I mean, we used to be three motherfuckers in the airplane. To go ahead and ask to pilot, co pilot, navigator. I mean, pilot, co pilot, navigator. (laughs) And you got the third motherfucker (laughs) in there no more hitting buttons and shit. So, um, what would you say? She think too. How do you how do you handle conflict? Like. Could if the conversation gets messy, because that will, you know, that could happen. Definitely. Um, how do you think that we could work that out? So, so it's um, dealing with different people. I would say you you deal with it differently. Like, should I give you space? Should I, you know, can I t- talk with you? For me, like I said, it's always conversation for me. But you do sometimes have to allow that grace. Like everyone is entitled Come to on, their man. moment. Let them have their moment, the and then nigga. let's talk no. about. It. Let's not go to sleep angry. You know what I mean? So um, as long as you're open-minded to uh, having a conversation care. about it eventually, I won't, my not immediately, you know, right. then I feel like we can get through conflict. We can get through a lot more than just conflict. Okay. I like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You don't have to stink and be alone, Kevin. You can use Old Spice Total Body Deodorant Spray. 24-7 freshness. Ooh. Smells good, right? Let's go over here. Okay, my question is, what is a quote or a life lesson that your parents taught you that you still live by today? Um, That's some hard shit. It definitely has to be accept what you can't change. Don't change trust too Bob. Um, through my own journey, my spiritual journey, things like this, there's things I've gone through, and it's like I, I try to make it a point to live life with no regrets and just Bob. looking forward to the future, accepting who you are, being comfortable with who you are, and um, moving like that. So I would say um, that's definitely my quote. Okay, nice. I have one more question. <laughs> Do you have children? Yes. How many? Two. What? How old are they? Um, thirteen and fourteen. Oh, okay. Do you want more? Um, I always say I would have another kid with a wife. Okay. You, you would have one. That's good, That's good for you? Me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Jawbone. So, it is time to make a decision based off of what you've heard so far. Which one out of these two beautiful ladies are you going to be popping their balloon? Um, once again, perfect questions, great answers. Definitely love it. But if I had to pop one, I'm going to go over here. And pop yours. Oh, big okay. mama. Why did we end up popping hers? Um, she didn't make it. You didn't truly, make it there's nothing wrong with her. I would say um, just based on the answers, she I like her a little bit more. Um, and that's literally it. Okay, cool. I think you're the other one looked better. Thank you. All um, right, so we do still have an unpopped balloon. Let me have you I say if you pick the big girl who was fucking tonight. Come on up. <laughs> oh, All right, any further questions from either one of you before we determine if this is a match? Um, no, I would like to talk to you privately. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I have one more question, one okay. more question. Okay, so um, this, my, this is my question like on vices. So I, I have a vice, even though I don't really get a lot of time to do it, but you know, I just like to be transparent. That's one thing I look for as well. So um, my question to you is what is your vice? But for me, mine is video games. How do you feel like about men who play video games? I play video games. Oh, there it is. <laughs> There it is. Um, <laughs> all right. Let me ask my final question. Okay. So is it going to be a yes for you for him? Yes. And is it a yes for you for her? Definitely. We got him! What's up? Hey, you got a match. All right. I'll take this mic. You guys can go Big on Big girl, you almost had it. Hey! Shit. No, that's a perfect Okay, let's go ahead. They go, but I see you, nephew. That's when you know you made one. The old man tell you, I see you. You done did something. You got something with you, boy. I see you now. I see you. But look, that's what the old players going to be saying to him. All right now. All right now, Keith, nigga. I see you. All right. Go ahead and bring out our next nigga. single guy. Hello. Welcome in. I'll have you hold Girl. on. What's your name? Uh, it's Tiano. What is that? It's Tiano. Tiano? Like, like piano with a T. Just spelled oh, differently. Okay, Tiano. Cool. Look, and this, how old are you? I don't do I'm stupid 31. names. 31. Okay, and what do you do? Um, I'm a multifaceted like, investor with a few companies <laughs> like uh, Denial Records, uh, Resurrect Select, um, Omeo Mars <laughs> and Pinatas, and First Down Catering. This nigga looks stupid. Have okay, cool, cool. Boy, and they say dress for the job you, you look for, want, for the job you um, have. Um, uh, definitely look for a woman who's kind. Very this nigga came happy. out looking like goddamn left eye TLC and Chili or t bars all in the same wrapped up in one. This nigga got, didn't he come out and say he's some type of intellectual investor? Boy, look, 
You better don't put on a suit and wrapping that shit up and try to cater to these bitches on some intellect shit. Nigga, you look dumb as hell, man. What can you put in that damn pocket over there, man? A fucking a CD player, a portable, a discman? Remember them? Like a Walkman, discman? You fit a discman in that motherfucker, yo. God damn, this outfit nasty. Let's get into it, man. It. Um, someone is willing to put in the work. You know, relationships take work. You mm-hmm. know, nothing that... You know, hey, go on with the fashion, bitch. Y'all can look like, stupid so, together. Just someone I definitely feel we big can... Big girl, jump out of this shit, man. Walk down this path together like and Eldris, try to accomplish big things. Eldris Hodge. All right, with a damn and now what are some of your deal breakers? Septum. Oh, um... This uh, nigga definitely boop. don't like someone who's just not motivated, not mm-hmm. really out there. Uh, this shit look like just clay. Be better for themselves. Okay. Uh, some people get so complacent these days. Is that brown? Is that dirty just, clay uh, brick? You know, kind of fizzle out. With a shirt out, underneath so, this shit. Disgusting, less, less man. Less what do you wear that? Together. What, what okay. is it? I am not that cool. Right, I can so wear we outfits and shit, man. Pop balloons. Let's go on over them and see what's going on. I can't wear outfits, yo. I can't wear dumb ass shit like that. Okay, if we can have your name and age and why you ended up. God. My name is Brenda, 36. I'm too grown for this shit. Attraction. The braids. Great. Not giving. That yarn at the end. Personality. You have things that obviously another woman might move forward with. Just not my cup of tea. It's all good. Yes. Definitely. Thank, Thank you. you. Mm-hmm. Well, I know the white house would Brenda love this nigga. Is your type? Um, probably wouldn't really know too much about her. It's about physical attraction. Mm-hmm. Uh, probably wouldn't be someone I would talk to right off the bat. Mm-hmm. Uh, just you can find some white hoes. They like, love this weird shit. With some of my things that I do. Him and Billie Eilish will hold hands, nigga. Like yourself, so. mm-hmm. You are in the woman, wrong like pool. Yourself, I apologize. No, bitches. you're fine. Thank you. All right. Thank yeah. you. That nose ring. Let's go over here. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Outfit. Brittany, 31. Um, so I just like to hear what people say. I don't like to just pop it right away. Um, but initially, it wasn't um, this style, the braids also, and then the piercing. So it just wasn't somebody I usually go for. Um, but that's all. I love your answers because I can relate to you everything you said. Up. I kind of feel like you described me in that way, but it's just I the tell you, man, this shit, the crazy yeah. shit about yeah. it. Thank this you. nigga some type right, of professional same nigga. Thing for, you know, Brittany, is she someone that you would approach if you saw her out? Not typically my type. I definitely wouldn't think I would say anything. Beautiful woman, mm-hmm. but definitely not something I would talk to at okay. the bar or anything. Is there like the any bar? specific oh, reason? Oh, n- nothing at all. Just honestly, just the vibe. Mm. Just gotta. F- I can feel the energy. So mm. I, it's a big thing. It's a big Thank test. You. Yeah. <laughs> right, over here. Uh, 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 Your name mode. and age and why you ended Defense up popping. Mode. I'm Tatiana. I am 25. Um, I'm basically, a bro. like aesthetically. Not necessarily like I dig what you got going on, but just like not for me like that. Right, that's but for you. The characteristics that you were naming, like, um, I feel kind of bad because I did have a little bit of drink, but I'm trying to remember. You did say a couple things. Like, I could see you more as like a potential business partner than an actual romantic partner. Like, I could see myself going like, like, because as far as like what you do and what I kind of do a little bit, I could see like, you know, how could mutualism benefit off of that. But Networking. as far as like, Anything romantic goes on, I just don't see it. Okay. Do you okay. see anything there? Uh, no, it's all good. It's a, like I said about energy. Um, I like the dress, I like the fit. Um, just I need a little bit, probably more body, I guess, for me. Mm-hmm. Just a little, a little, I like a woman, a little bit more curves. Damn. That's just my personal preference, <laughs> I guess. All right. Yeah. She's funny as shit. Get her this back on the show. This Charmin Ultra man. Soft Smooth Tear uh, is so soft and so smooth. She comedy. Sh- Let's go over she here. Honest, she, she, if we she have your name and dope. age and why you ended up popping. Somebody else. My name is Unique. That's I'm 31. I'm kind of mad I popped too soon because the more I like look at you, the more I kind of feel like you're different. And I like different, but I really, I'm not familiar with different, if that makes sense. So yeah, of I mean, course. you're very handsome. I love how you're, you. you step outside the box. I'm more yeah, like this nigga's gonna be on the skateboard so, commercial know. next month. That's why I popped my balloon. That's just, you need, I don't know. It's real I don't, different. I, I don't know if I'm like scared. <laughs> I see the nigga got the big earrings. I really don't know. But that ain't shit niggas do really. I love your energy. energy. You got good energy. The There's nothing wrong with you. you call it Stay the same. Inner circle <laughs> thing. That's all I have. So are you considering a balloon or? Yeah, in a way I am because I do want to get to know more about him because I never dealt with somebody that really stands on what they feel and how they really, you know. The braids, 
all that. Like it's different. Okay. So I kind of like a man that kind of steps outside the box. Cause in a way. look at you. All right. Thanks. I, that's like kind of what I go for. I'm, yeah. I know I'm not trying to be for everyone, so I'm more of an acquired taste. So it's just a little bit different. It's okay to be scared, but you gotta. You gotta <laughs> uh, yeah. Try it first, you know what I'm saying? I'm getting to learn myself even more. Like you know, so patience. Hate, that's all it takes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. We do have a balloon ready for you. Are we? Are we? Are we giving it along to you? <laughs> How do you feel about kids? I, I have a son. You have a yeah, son? I do. How old? He's two, age? turns three this year. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> and yourself, do you have kids? I do. Okay. I How do. Many? I have a 16 year old and a 13 year old. Okay. So I'm kind of like, That's okay. I'm still trying to build. If that makes sense? I understand. I want my own tribe. I honestly want my partner and my leader to know exactly what the now you want a leader. it is they want. And go off that. You're bitches. I submit naturally. Okay. Understood. Yeah. Like that. Like that. Okay. She wearing flats though, man. Them shits like. <laughs> is, it, is, it, is it a yes or no? It's a no. I don't. Okay. You know, okay. I'm not sure. That's I'm fine. not sure, and I'm also scared. Okay. So I'm not gonna sit up there and force something on myself that I know I'm not, I'm not ready sure. for. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure. Definitely. Okay. Yeah. That's fair. I'm not gonna. <laughs> yeah. Respect but that. I most definitely. Think there's nothing wrong with you. Stay the same. Thank you. No matter what she, she, she wants to stand on say. business. Yeah. 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 Okay, cool. Yes. Let's go back over here. We did get a popped balloon. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Yes, I'm Chidor. I'm 31. Um, I ended up popping because initially I was like, okay, you're not really my type. But then you seem very interesting. So I was like, I don't know. Let me hear more. Let me see. And then um, you were like, you know, you like a, a woman with a little bit more. And I'm very slim. And I oh, love this is the last call for alcohol. Slimness, but I you know, you know, know I like now. a little bit more. There's nothing wrong with that. Not sure. You know, but I just figured I probably wasn't for you. So. I love your style, though. It actually oh, would have been great. You. It would have been fun to just get to know you a little bit more. It's a little bit different, you know? I just do enjoy Big girl and pop down now. You look great, honestly. I love the colors. It's, it stands you. out a lot. She didn't yeah. pop. Thank you. Okay, can I get a balloon back? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. See, don't, don't pop just because, you know, he said it for somebody else. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Okay, we'll be back for you then. Okay. We did get a pop over okay. here. <laughs> she looked like, damn, I want All my right, balloon back, too. All right, your name and age and why you ended up popping. I'm Micah. I'm 33, and I ended up popping just because I can't get over the septum piercing. Mm. Yeah. But you seem cool, though. I like your energy and how you presented yourself, so wish you the best. Thank you. May as well. Sure. Okay. Those aren't contacts, are they? They are contacts. They are? Yeah, they Never are. Never mind. <laughs> and, uh, it looked good on you. I, I just, see, I, I would have like, if yeah. you would have said, yeah, these are me, I would have been like, damn, see, bro. See, th but the difference is, is like, I did that because I try to take away from the superficial. A lot of things happen with lashes and hairs and all these other things, and I'm just one of these guys who just enjoys this doing nigga a whole goddamn. So no, I definitely about, dig so. it because they look good on you for sure. Thank like you. that's a really good yeah, like color fucking... choice. Appreciate it. But that's why I was like, no, that's not real. It can't be. No, like, my is mom it? told me about them at 13, and I was like. Done. It's a wrap. Been doing it no, I feel since. that completely. Ever no, you're since, good. No, nah, yeah. Okay. You're good. Yeah. All right. We're not finished so over here. <laughs> so you said it was just a septum ring. Apart from that, everything else was okay for you? Well, um, well, you not get everything. Back in I'm just not attracted. Um, yeah. I feel like the hairstyle, I just would like that more on me than my man. But mm. <laughs> Okay. Got it. You, you called him back to say that? Is Micah someone that is your type? Um, honestly, Micah, you remind me so much of my mother, who's a beautiful okay. woman. Wow. But you really do. She's just, <laughs> she wears the same hairstyle, the same thing, same color earring. So it's just, that's the only thing I couldn't get over in general. Ooh. Like, But I love my mom to death. I still call her mommy. <laughs> so I wish you nothing but the best. But you just kind of reminded my mom. Well, quick. I am going to be a great mother. So I accept that. Energy I'm for sure you are. She's amazing. Drop out of Sophia, too. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, let's go. <laughs> All right, so we did have our unpopped balloon over here. Well, she did get it back. Did you have a question that you wanted to ask her to kind of, you know, help it? I tell you, y'all got some dumb ass shit um, together. Y'all can go right up into the sunset. Yeah. Um, and they got them both What do you think it beetle. takes to acquire lasting love? Oh, I think um, honesty and really wanting to get to know everything about the person that you're with. You know, wanting to really being that interested um, because things are not always going to be perfect, you know, but when you really get to know a person, I feel like, um, oh, 
sorry. Um, when you really get to know a person, I feel like that's how you're able to work through everything. It's not a matter of just, oh, you made me mad one day, but you're like, I love you. I love the person you are. How can we get through What are you this? talking about? You know about? what I mean? Yeah. So, um, yeah, I would say that. <laughs> okay. 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 Damn, man. okay. Let me just have you. Nigga Come just like a rapper here. to rapper and his friends or something. Oh, okay. Before we before we ask the there. question. <laughs> um, when you pass, um, what do you want to be remembered for? Oh my God. Oh. You my nigga dying uh, shit. We I always to live, thought about bitch. that. Honestly, I wanna really help my family with generational wealth. It's something that I feel that we lack. So I wanna be remembered. It's some dumb shit. Mm -hmm. Okay, can we you, oh you coming out? Uh, and we're back with Rachel, a specialist. That's what I get trying to fast forward. You don't sneak one more Rachel ad split. in. Really, I have to go through all of them? Okay. Um, I have an <laughs> I have an eight year old, care. a six year old. Ask any more questions. I'm like, no, this is That's a major. big one. I'm glad I you asked that. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. I, I, know, I appreciate not you. Not for me, but someone else. Maybe you guys team up cheaper by the dozen. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Uh, Somebody's going to the league out of it. I feel you guys got a few. A you couple of them. A couple of them. Like, I'm All telling right, you. I'm telling you. I'll have you just step back okay. over there. All right. Huh? Well, we were unable to find yeah. you a match today. You but let's go ahead kids. and give it up for him, ladies. Thank you, ladies. Thank you guys so much. Have a good night. <laughs> you as well. <laughs> See? That's how it happened, man. He found out about all them goddamn kids she had, man. Anyway, we go live on this channel every Friday at 9 p.m. Talking about something, man. Come to and holler at me, man. That has been Pop the Balloon episode. I mean, Pop the Balloon to Find Love episode 9, part 2. We're going to do part 10. Then we're going to do 11. That's what they got so far. So, man, stay with your boy and holler at your boy. The fuck with me, man. See what else I got going on on this channel, man. I do all type of shit on this channel. I'm talking about something or something or something or something. But I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Pop the Balloon to Find Love part 4. I mean, damn. Beep, 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 beep. Part nine. We got to do, man. Hit the button. This is a dangerous group that groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality. I'll be there.